Hey pets, welcome back. We are continuing our sessions with Knights of Pen and Paper. Last session we went to visit the king a little bit. This session we are actually going to do this merchant quest. Mm, now let's go ahead and just go and go journey to the go to journey village. Let's go ahead and do that. Good to go on the adventure. Go through the forest. No problems there. No problems getting a journey village. Good to go. So let's look around. Um, the blacksmith doesn't matter where he is. His level is the same. And the item shop is probably the same way. Alright. Blacksmith cost minus two percent. Really? That's useful. It's not a lot, but it is useful. Alright, let's try our quest in. Now, from here, so they want rose sand. So it is different because. In the other town, we had a level 9 quest for the merchant. And here, we have a level 18 delivery quest. Okay. Uh, slice some cacti. Okay, so... Since the strike quests seem to be easier than the kill quests, Let's do the Sandros. Let's do this one first. Ah, uh, you look around to find something to do in Johnny Village. Roll. You must... You spot a woman that has certain sadness in her face. You tried talking to her to see what's going on. Hey, woman, can you tell us what happened? You look sad. <laughs> Blunt. Ah, uh, woman. Hello, adventure. It is my brother. He was killed a while ago. Uh, there is a mage that everyone says is trying to perform forbidden ritual. It looks like this is part of the ritual. Anyway, he loved these sand roses that are spread all over this sand, sands of time desert. <laughs> And I can't really gather any of them because it's too dangerous. I believe we can do that for you. Like sand roses at the sands of time desert. I uh, flying guys. There it is. Uh did not have any car on the way there. Just a TARDIS in the background, and the flying dice in the background. There's a pyramid with a cross cut out of it. I love the art. This is fantastic. This is just so fantastic. Okay. Um, we had five roses. Sand monsters. There's 77 hit points. Let's only do two. Let's get our bearings on these guys. Now we can done three. Let's look at one around. So yeah, we can definitely do three. That would be hard to... Oh, he's got a cleave! Let's... That's a thing. Oh, there's a Stargate back there! I didn't notice that one at first. Okay. Ten. Okay, so we rest with that issue. Alright. Need four more. 
Let's see if we do all ones. It's gonna hurt. It's definitely gonna hurt. But like I said, we can do it in like one round, so. It's not that big of a deal. Now the thief, I gave him those two mana necklaces. And, and I mean really one of them is just being held for from um He's holding one of them for the uh, warrior when he gets there. Circle. <sighs> yeah, we're gonna have to. Uh, yeah, it's when he gets 10. So that's good. And rest. We haven't been trapped sleeping yet. And we had that one early one with that. That stupid slot. I want that fight. We'll just do one so we can finish this up real quick. Okay, I just want to finish this um, particular adventure real quick. And move on. Alright, quest. Uh, still eating sandals. Really? Alright, well. I wasn't expecting them to be a pest. About it, but. Yes, it is what it is. I mean, we don't have to worry about too much. So, I mean, I could have healed, but it really wasn't necessary. Now I have to heal. Uh, two sandwiches, there we go. Let's go ahead and rest. Well, that was real close. We almost didn't make that. So I am doing the same system. Get health plus one. Okay. Not really a um, fantastic item, but alright. It's, it's fine. Oh, thank you. So much, so much, yes. That's it. That, that, that was not at all. We have some difficulty finding the woman's brother's grave. The description she gave you was not good enough. Maybe you should look in the sands of Time Desert. Funny angle, and the they don't use the um, the analog stick, just the D-pad. So we have a big scorpion. He looks like he's got about 80 hit points, so it's not too bad. So yeah, little radio hit points. He wasn't too at all, it was crazy. Alright. All of a sudden you step on something rigid. You look down and see the inscription. Woman's brother's grave. <laughs> the lack of inventiveness is actually inventive. I have to give him that. The lack of inventiveness is inventive. 
look, this is the grave. Uh, you place the sand roses on his grave and here's James out. Boy, look. Um, the grave trembles. You step aside and you're all terrified by the loud sound. You woke me up. Thanks. I shouldn't be surprised at this point. Uh, so your name is... We just knew you by women's brother. I never knew my name. I shall return home and talk to my sister. She thinks you're dead. Are you sure? Wait, what happened? I uh, cursed by the black mage. I remember something was controlling me and I was put to sleep like I was dead. You woke me up when you brought that sand rose to my grave. It reminded it reminded of my sister and awakened me. It's supposed to be a me in there. It reminded me of my sister and awakened me. The woman God Alright, give me a mana potion. I can take that. Alright, so I'm gonna do something here real quick. Take that off. Take that off. Put that on. Power of the mage. I'm going to have to get him a ring. That's okay. Alright, so the, he's got one more point. Let's... Let's do this again. Oh, we have the choice to do what we want to do. Oh, I should travel to... Okay. Uh, good to know, it seems so weird. I'm curious about it. So it looks like our quest builds are... Interesting. Alright, so, quest. Uh, you have arrived at the village and hurried to listen to Question Mark's story. Hey, Question Mark. We have come to find out what happened. Hello again. Are you ready for my story? It all began some nights ago. A powerful mage tried to get me... Tried to get me... The Forest Temple's guardian. To work with him. So, mage enchanted you and stole an artifact. I think that the forbidden ritual needs all the other temple artifacts. If he manages to do it, he'll be powerful enough to travel between worlds. These artifacts are known as the pen and paper artifacts. <laughs> I have so much to do. Be careful. Fine. So let's go ahead and rest up real quick. And... What I do here is I want to... Shop. Now if I hit level 12... Being level 12, random magic copy a little bit, okay, I don't know about that. Magic plus 15, oh, we're here with magic. Let's see. Here you go, experience necklace plus 6, please. Okay, 
because Okay, what we'll do here is take these off. Put those on. So he's got six, ten. So he's like twenty one percent. Not the cleric, I the cleric. I thought the, the lady would be really low. Gives him thirteen. Clerk take those, and we can throw up that one. We can escort question mark level 13 though, it's kind of high. Or we do the catch swipe. Let's do the catch swipe. Random villager. Hello, traveler. Will you take us, help us out a task? It's quite easy. All you need to do is battle a few monsters. Sure, why not? We'll deal with some desert, deal with some desert monsters, okay? trying to do all seven at once. This should be entertaining. Because we hit so hard. It's kind of hard to say. Uh, maybe it's a little too much. Shield is ten. Oh, healer. Yeah, it's gonna be a tight one. Do we get these guys' numbers down? But we'll get there. We just have to, um, outlast his deep off. It's gonna be kind of tight. There we go. Okay, so now they're hitting other people. strike thing. Wow, 
this is really gonna be close. Down to three. He's out of magic! He's out of magic too. That's even worse. Yeah, just keep that up so you can... There we go, we're getting there. There we go. Alright, go to two. Okay, so we're making progress. And we haven't lost anybody. I'm actually impressed at how well balanced the um the combat is. Cause I expected to lose the um paladin already. We're still okay. Okay, I got one more round and we've got it. So it's pretty. It's really solid. Excuse me, that was wow. Okay, I. Yeah. Um let's face this one. Alright, so we need to rest in town. I think we can rest in town, that's that's free. Alright, so let's see what's free. Okay, let's turn the bus in. We have more experience, which gives us this guy's level up. That's what's 13. That's the next quest. We're a little low for that. So, let's. Go back to town real quick. So, we go back to default village. Um. We can grab. Cost. I want to buy some ale items. Where's the merchant? Uh, you've checked this this tent, but couldn't find it. Perhaps you should ask a blacksmith. Hey, blacksmith! Have you seen the merchant? Well, last time I saw him, he was he said he was going to the uh, den of the devil to gather some crafting materials. But that was two days ago. Maybe he got trapped in there? Oh no! Don't worry, we'll find him. Maybe that's what got us, was like a, this, a level 9 uh, monster. Oh crap, I didn't you do that. I didn't need to waste the magic on that. Not that it costs him much magic. Because I'm leveling up his poison attack. Not his, um... Double attack, so it doesn't take a lot of magic. It's just doing a standard attack twice.
Okay. This is that slime that we fought before. That actually had a lot of hit points. It's actually not that bad, but having a hundred hit points or so was really rough when we were level five. He gets to do a lot of damage real early. There we go. I didn't get surprised, but that was quite a bit of um, beat up. Alright, so here's the King Slime. And he does have a lot of hit points. So he's got about 150. Not too bad, really. You can actually get anywhere near level. It was bad because maybe 200. Uh, we were so low level, and he had we were only doing like three to five damage. <laughs> Ten was a critical hit. Now rest while you have time. Well, thank you. We love you. Glad we um didn't have a random encounter along the way. Not sure we would have made it. Gets to the mining thing then. So that's good. Okay, find our guy rhinestone. Let's get some more. Another one. Alright. That one missed. Alright, so. Except merchant. You did it. Now you can get back to work. Thanks. Alright. Merchant is back in town. Got some carrots. Now what happens if we just... Okay, so we have the choice of doing the bat. The elite, the dark bat, or the vampire bat. The slime. We got 77 hit points. Uh, 130, that's about 150. Um... Okay. And you can take out as many of them. You would take out seven of them. You would so die. We can do bad. It seems you're having too much fun. I'm going to spawn some monsters. Uh, okay, calm down. Kill six bats. I'll do them all at once. Thank you. Thank you, we'll just kill them all at once. It's not like it's gonna be much of a headache. But, it'll be fun. So each zone, Apparently has its own little quest list, and that's cool. All right, don't worry about that. Yeah, I'll see. So now we get the little kid quest. Suddenly you start to hear strange sounds. What's happening? I'm doing a perception check, and let me do it. Uh, let me do it. I do it roll perception check. Wow, nice. 20 back there. You hear the sounds of a child crying. Hey, that's where it was going from. Go hit stop. Hey, kid. Didn't you see you had the, that default food a while ago? Look, what's up? Yes, my, I want my mom. What my mom? I want my mom. Okay, we're gonna take you back. Come.
I would assume no, I'm not sure. Oh, look. This is where that cleave comes in handy. Because you can get rid of a whole bunch of monsters at once when you have these little trash mobs. Alright, so, turn the kid in. Don't get lost again. I promise. Uh, you are so brave. Okay. We love you too. Alright, let's do our level up real quick. I don't know how high this can go, but we're gonna keep pushing it. Mm -hmm. I think this one here is gonna be keep pushing that. Alright, so that's that session, everybody. It's been a blast doing these. Um, I'm gonna keep recording, but we will continue this. We will continue Knights of Pen and Paper through um, more of these 30 minute ish sessions. So, bear with it. Let's see where the story goes. Have a good day.